Pepe community, welcome back to the channel. And uh, guys, if you have yet to subscribe right here, we're talking about Pepe every single day. So show your love, show your support. And uh, I love everybody out there who's in cryptocurrency right now, man. You guys have really withstood the test of time of 2022 because 2023 thus far has been a gift. And so many things happening right now with Pepe. We're going to talk about is Robinhood next up? The community wants it. Uh, and we're going to dive into that later on in the video. Make sure you guys stick around for that. But I want to talk about this price action because we've been talking about this really now for over the last 24-hour period. I'm going to go way back on my chart where I got this signal flashed, uh, possible retracement up. This was on May 8th. Now, this signal that I'm using is very accurate. Uh, it's not always indicative of what exactly is going to play out, but... So far, this has played out. Possible retracement up when we wick down all the way to the 15 level. We have bounced up. And look at the sideways action. We continue to talk about it. The last hour, we saw a red candle, but we held support, right? And now we're bouncing back up. So on the technicals, it's showing a strong sell, though, okay? Because the moving averages are down. Now, we don't have a ton of data here, okay? We don't have a ton of data. So take this with a grain of salt. On the oscillators, it's showing neutral. But again, the more data we have there, the more those uh, technical indicators are more accurate. Here's what I'm looking at, though, right now. Let me drop myself over in this other corner real quick. Take a look at that RSI that I was blocking there for a minute. Stay right here where my cursor is going across. We are basically flatlining right now. Basically, what's happening is the buyers and sellers of Pepe have basically met in the middle right now. What does this mean? I know I've been reiterating this, but I know new people are seeing these videos all the time. This essentially means that buyers and sellers have agreed on a price point right now. However, in cryptocurrency, things do not stay boring very long, especially with Pepe being hot on the market, being listed on new exchanges. I think we're going to see a big breakout or a breakdown. Now, what will it be? That is the big question. We've been trading in this tight range. It's not going to last forever. Well, one of the catalysts that could help us potentially break out, I'll bet it could be a buy the rumor, sell the news event, but we could get a breakout from it if this news were to come out, is a potential listing on Robinhood. Pepecoin community is hopeful of a Robinhood listing. Now, here's why this is interesting. How many people hold their Dogecoin on Robinhood? Drop in the comments if you hold Dogecoin on Robinhood. There's a ton of people. Imagine this. Imagine this. Imagine Pepe gets listed there, and people start rotating some of their Doge or all of their Doge to Pepe. It could happen, right? Because it's the hottest new thing, and hey, let me go try to catch some quick gains over here, and then maybe move it back into Dogecoin later. That is possible, right? And there are just people who only use Robinhood to trade their cryptocurrencies. So... Robinhood Pepe listing could be soon, potentially. In terms of asset listing of Pepe, two major platforms that are yet to take initiative are Robinhood and Coinbase, popular influencers in the cryptocurrency market. Hey, there's Jake. Jake Gagan right there saying Robinhood should list Pepe next. I think they're crazy not to. I agree with Jake here, and I think Coinbase should be right behind them. Here's what we do know about Coinbase, and here's our best example of how this played out recently, somewhat recently. If you remember back in 2021, Shiba Inu got listed on Binance first. It was actually in May of 2021. And it wasn't until later that year into October until it got listed on Coinbase. Will Coinbase wait this long to do it? And Robinhood even waited longer. Of course, Robinhood listed SHIB here in 2022 after all the dust settled. So it'll be interesting to see what's going to play out here. But the community certainly wants it. And it certainly can't hurt getting listed there on Robinhood and Coinbase. Uh, it'll be interesting to see if that alone acts as a catalyst for Pepe Coin if this were to happen. But again, I'm going to take you back. Even without all of these potential news events that could happen or potential catalysts that could happen in, in, in the way of exchanges, we are just seeing it from a technical perspective here. Things have to shift. Something's got to give. Something's got to give. And we're going to see what's next here for Pepe. We'll be right here breaking it down. Make sure you guys are locked in. Hit that subscribe button. Put the notification bell on so you don't miss out on any content. We're dropping tons of videos every single day for you right here on the channel. Appreciate you guys. We'll see you in the next video. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Take care.